about to happen, people. It's happening right now. I am, as of right now, officially back in the sunshiny state of North Carolina. Uh, it has been a travel-filled month of January for me, and uh, I'm really, really excited to be almost home. So my wife and I, we spent a couple weeks in South Africa, and while I was there, I got to work with some local teachers, got to help them out on uh, putting some lesson plans together, putting some resources together. Uh, it was awesome. I got to tour a local school, and I got to make some connections because Studio Time with Mr. B next year is going global, people, global. So I got more to tell you about that in the coming months, but uh, it was a great trip, all right? Amazing teachers over there. Then I came back, I taught at a few schools in North Carolina, and I headed down to Athens, Georgia for GMEA. Teachers in Georgia, y'all, doing it right, all right? It was an awesome conference. Uh, I presented twice, I saw a lot of friendly faces. Uh, y'all were very kind to me, that was excellent. I had a great time. Uh, then I came back, taught in a couple schools, and I headed up to OMEA, to the heart of it all, the homeland, the motherland for me, Ohio. Um, Ohio, fantastic conference, absolutely amazing. I had no idea what to expect. It was great to be home. Um, it was great to get to meet all of you. I saw so many people that came to one session and then came to the next session. I saw so many people that I recognized in the halls. It was just awesome. Y'all were so kind to me. Uh, it felt good to be home. So I gave teachers in Georgia and in North Carolina, I gave them both some homework and their homework was to create an original song that would teach students with autism to look both ways before crossing the street. That was their homework and I wanted to see if anyone would do it. And I actually had teachers in Georgia and I had teachers in Ohio both accept that challenge, which was awesome. So I've posted those, check out this link. I've posted those songs for you guys, all right? Now remember, if these songs don't work exactly how you think they should or how you want them to, you can edit them, all right? We talked about editing. You can use flat.io, that's your resource right there, all right? Free online music creator. Um, so if it doesn't work perfectly for you, that's okay. No one is gonna come sue you, all right? So check those songs out, use them because they're gonna work, all right? Um, it was awesome, I had a great time, and here's what I learned. So here's what I learned when I was in Africa, Georgia, Ohio, all around North Carolina. Okay, what I learned is that I'm changing lanes. What I learned is that there are great teachers who are continuing to do this job and you are not alone. I'm not alone, we are not alone. Sometimes as music teachers, I know it feels like we're out on an island, we're the only one in the building who gets what we do, we're the only one in the building probably who really even sees the value in what we do, but there are teachers all over Georgia, all over North Carolina, all over Ohio, even all the way in South Africa that are choosing every day to get up, pour into the kids in their community and make that place a better place to make this world a better world, more compassionate, more artistic, all right? And I am proud to stand next to y'all as you guys wake up every day to do that too. And I met so many college students too, who are choosing willingly, knowing what they're getting into, knowing what the culture of education is, knowing the way that our country feels about education right now, they are willingly diving in head first to that board. And I commend you and I thank you for it. So teachers, you are not alone. Hey, thank you guys so much for all your hospitality over this last month of January. Um, if you guys find value in this newsletter, if you find um, some inspiration, feel free to share it with a friend, all right? That's the best thing that you can do because we're all here to lift each other up, all right? We are a community of teachers who care. So thank you guys very much. Keep doing what you're doing because I know you're doing it well. I'll catch you soon. Peace.